Well, first of all, you know, uh, I've gotten to know him, uh, and he's a very, very decent person. Uh, he's got thousands of employees. You're going to have a real hard time finding one that doesn't like him. He okay. treats people so fairly. Uh, you look at how his kids turn out. That tells mm -hmm. you a great deal about the man. Yeah. They are very uh, cool, uh, hardworking, respectful, mm -hmm. just great, great young people. Um, but also, you have to be pragmatic. Uh, if you're dealing with a situation where you have a one party uh, that espouses government control of your life from cradle to grave, uh, you know, killing babies, uh, obliteration of any of the morals that are suggested in the Bible, and you have another that looks to fiscal responsibility, a strong military, personal responsibility. Um, I'm going to want that second one to win. I'm not going to want the other one to win. So I'm going to look for the Somebody. first stick your head in the sand and <laughs> say, you know, I have no responsibility here. Uh, so I did that analysis, and it was very apparent which way I needed to go. But then I had to say, who should I support? Well, by that time, there's only, what, three people left. Uh, Kasich had no chance of winning except through a broker convention, which would mm -hmm. completely splinter the party, mm -hmm. and there would be no possibility of winning anything. Uh, Cruz had the ability mm -hmm. to attract only very conservative people, would never attract mm -hmm. people across the lines. Trump, on the other hand, was bringing in record numbers, record numbers of people. And at the same time, the pollsters, the pundits were all saying, well, he'll be slaughtered by Hillary. This was their narrative because they wanted the party to reject him. Uh, but the fact of the matter is, already the polls show them pretty much even. And I think as time goes on, you're going to see Trump pulling ahead quite a bit because mm -hmm. the things that he's talking about are relevant, not just to Republicans, but to Democrats. And I think as people begin to recognize that this is America, this is a country that is up for and by the people, and, and that we don't have to be ashamed of the heritage that allowed this nation to go from nowhere to the pinnacle of the world mm -hmm. in record time, and that our Constitution is important, uh, including the First Amendment, freedom of religion, mm -hmm. which uh, Donald Trump believes in strongly. Um, so I think you're going to see a pretty significant shift going on here. And the other thing that's going to happen, and I'm going to make sure it does, uh, is that the Republican platform and what they advocate will be relevant. Matters of opportunity that allow people through their God-given talents and hard work to become successful.